I am convinced that there is a path we can take forward that both honors our responsibility to protect the historic and cultural resources of Nantucket Sound and at the same time meets the needs to repower our economy with clean energy produced from wind power. That's, what I, that's why I am conditioning the, the approval of the project on the requirement that the developer adhere to the additional stringent binding measures we have included in the record of decision to minimize and to mitigate the potential adverse impacts of construction and operation of the facility. We are reducing the scale of the project from 170 turbines to 130 turbines to reduce the visual impact. I am requiring the developer to conduct additional marine archaeological surveys in the area of potential effect to limit any potential effect on submerged archaeological resources, historic or prehistoric, that might be found. And we're requiring the developer to take other steps to make the turbines less visible from the shore. I believe these and other common sense measures will allow us to strike the right balance and ensure the project is developed appropriately and responsible.